Hello, we're heading south to Silver City and we just passed the San Francisco River and on the side of the road we saw a sediment um, and it is really white. So what we're doing, I got pliers which is um, really not required. You can see this is really white and it's I'm grabbing from underneath here and uh, it breaks off very easy and it's very powdery. So this is what's been used by my grandmother with making the wider wool more white. And it's this stuff here and it's um, from the rain the, it's got kind of a shell. You can hear it, it's kind of hollow so the top part is what's coming off real easy. This sediment, sedimentation, it's got a layer that's kind of more, uh, maybe a light brown. But I've gotten up to the top of it where it is the widest. You can see right here, it's really white. And just from the pressure of my hand, it's able to fall apart. So. I'm just collecting it in a black bag and it's used to make the wool more white. So we're just over here on the side of the road. We're going to eventually go to Las Cruces and visit our my uh, cousin Deanna. And we saw this and figured we might as well harvest some of this uh, white sedimentation and uh, use it to make the white wool more white. It's a tradition that uh, uh, my grandmother used on her white wool. So we're keeping up the practice, keeping up the family tradition, and uh, hopefully we'll make our wool white to use in our weaving. <laughs> 